Hey man, <laughs> it's it's some crazy going on right now, man. That everybody needs to be aware of because uh, uh, evidently Brian Kemp done reopened yeah, certain places. So Keisha Lance Bottom had no, no idea. Check this out. My 18 year old, who'll be 18 tomorrow, came running into the room to announce to me that the governor said he could leave home. So as a parent, I am concerned. Because what I know is that when I look at the data that we receive from our public health department each day, our numbers are going up. We get a count at noon and we get one at 7 p.m. When I look at the 24-hour period for uh, the 7 p.m. count we got today, our death rate is up by almost 14%. Our positives up almost 7% and we are not testing asymptomatic in people with mild symptoms. And so it concerns me. I have a great working relationship with our governor, uh, but I did not speak with him before he made this announcement. I spoke with Mayor Hardy Davis, who is the mayor of Augusta, Georgia, the second largest city in the state. He did not speak with the governor. I've spoken with several leaders across the state. So we really are at a loss, and I am concerned as a mother and as the mayor of our capital city. Well, the governor uh, makes the talking to him part easier because he says, you don't have to talk to me because you can't undo this. See? Um, no locality See? can overturn How the this. How the hell can you say that? The, who the fuck are you now, to say that? That's a political play. Uh, to make it's a political play. And for him not it's to a have political to play, but at the same time, and that's okay on why but now the bigger would you do that and not... On his shoulders, which See, is but that's, 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 the, that's, that's, the, that's the dumb, the dumb, dumb part about this, right? Every, uh, to come on and make the dumb part to me is the fact that why would you just make the decision and not go through other people that's important too you know what i'm saying it has a voice too about it but like you I, see listen see 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 you like kim come on bro like come on bro you really gotta think more logically you really gotta think more logical who you getting your information from like who are you talking to that's telling you like hey Go on ahead and just make that call. Get these people back outside so they so more people can catch it. Like that's how I see it, and I know that's how you see it. Man, that's a, that, that's exactly how I see it. Like, how can you not talk to the mayor of Atlanta? Mm -hmm. How can you not? That's just like making a decision. I, that's like making a decision like that and not talking to the president. Hey, look, we better make it, we better make move on your land, right? Mm -hmm. We ain't got to talk to you. That shit. Now in the metro area, you know we have the most people. The most people. We the next. We, we, we the next Hollywood down here. You know what I'm saying? So look, check this out. Case on this, he says you guys are in a better position than you were uh, a month or so. I don't feel. And I don't see the that. Data shows that Watch over the, the last numbers. couple of weeks, you've seen a flattening in cases. Is that enough for you to have confidence? that there's enough testing capacity, that's not there's enough true. treatment capacity of what could happen in Atlanta, which is a huge density area. <laughs> look at look at, that, look at them man. cases. Chris look at how many deaths there are. Position, it's because and that's just for coronavirus, man. Asking people to stay home. That's why we are in a better position. And it will go Our up. Our metro area has about 6 million people, more than half the population ah, in the so entire state. So if, if Kemp knows, if Kemp knows that it's going to go up, where are our if Kemp knows that it's going to go up, why reopen stuff? In areas like Bibb County. Why reopen stuff? It's about the money. Down, yeah, it's, it's, so about, it's, about that, it's about that dollar. That's what it is. Think about Albany, Georgia, which has had one of the worst outbreaks in the country. That, by and large, came from two funerals. And so I'm, I'm, I'm perplexed um, that we have opened up in this way. And again, I can't stress enough, I work very well with our governor, and I look forward to having a better understanding of what his reasoning is. But as I look at the data, and as I talk with our public health officials, I don't see what, that it's based on anything uh, that's logical. And, and and to me and to me to me to me it ain't logical. It ain't logical. Like Kim, if you know that the cases are going to go up, my brother. Well you're not even with my brother, but I don't know why I said that. <laughs> but if you know the case is gonna go up, bro. Why the fuck reopen shit? Why the fuck reopen shit? If the case is gonna go up, that means more fatalities, man. 
That means more of a death toll. Because you can't, you can't predict and say how many people going to beat it. You know what I'm saying? Which is why we've been quarantined. We, we've been quarantined. You know what I'm saying? And see America, I feel like, uh, 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 I, and I see it, I say America because I'm not just only talking to you know, Georgia, I'm, I'm, I'm talking to America. We have the decision right now. We can either play these folk game and let them, okay, we got business open now, we can go play this, this, this stupid game, or let's know facts. Let's keep our ass at the house quarantine so therefore we can stay a little safe until they find out what the hell is going on around here. Yeah, they already found out what's going on. It is so they get can 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 be able to control it. Yeah. That's the only thing, you know what I'm saying? Until they can be able to control it. But hey, y'all tell me what y'all think, man. Just let just let me know down in the comments, man, what y'all think. Because like, this was just break just breaking news. You know what I'm saying? I don't know how many people seen it yet, but that you know this is this is beyond me. This is beyond me because I got small kids. You know what I'm saying? And I'd be damned if one of us catch that. I'd be damned if one of us catch that. You know what I'm saying? So let's just let's everybody just stay safe. You know what I'm saying? Stay inside. Go to the store when you need to. Make sure you wear your mask. Make sure you got your gloves on. You know all of that. You know what I'm saying? And I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace.